thing better not get leaked, brothers. I, I got, I got, the, I got four folk I gotta look at. <laughs> I know, that's fucking how it happened. You're like, I'm telling you. It'd be, friends, it'd be your friends. It'd be your friends and leave your stuff. My name is Jesse Wusuwansa. I hail from Brooklyn, New York, and my parents are from the beautiful nation of Ghana, West Africa. So I need all my Ghanaians to support me. My passion for music. Wow, it started honestly as early as I can remember from an early age. I always remember my parents just kept the house always going with all different types of music. I love to worship God. Everything that has to do with getting into God's presence. Um, as it relates to worship, praising, prayer, I, I love it all. A huge influence of mine is um, African music, everything from Nigerian to Ghanaian, you know, from the West African region. So I'm definitely looking forward to bringing more sounds that are coming from the heart of Africa. I love colors. I'm not afraid of colors. Um, you know, growing up, I've seen my parents wear everything from African lace to Italian suits to just everything. And then definitely growing up in New York City, I'm, I've been exposed to so many different styles. So um, my background and the city have definitely had a huge impact as it relates to my personal style. So I love just about a little bit of everything. Uh, my new single is called Rescue Me. Um, I wrote it and my producer Will with Radical Producer he actually produced the track and uh, it was just a song that uh, was birthed in my spirit as it relates to just the everyday believer and what we go through and just our conversations with God and how oftentimes we question so many things that happen in our everyday world and so you know the song basically speaks for itself you know asking God to come and rescue me rescue us from what we're in or what we've been placed in just stay tuned because you're gonna hear a plethora of music you're gonna hear all types of sounds and variations and it's all gonna be centered on Christ but still yet you know enjoyable for everyone so it's gonna be good for your mama to listen to and for you to listen to we hear the cliche all the time about it's praying time it's praying time but you know the Bible also tells us that men ought to always pray and so this is definitely a time where you know we need to seek the face of God like never before I would definitely jump and use that as well um, and basically like I said you know just really cry out to God and start having that deep intimate relationship with God to stay connected with God knowing that we have power and authority to come overcome all darkness well one of the things I, I would love to leave uh, uh, in the minds of the people yes as a legacy or in the minds of the people as it relates to me is someone a young man who's driven who's passionate about the things of God not per se chasing material things but my, my heart's desire my passion is, is to see people restored, those that have already been in the faith and those who have not even come yet to know Christ. So that is one of my biggest passions is to just draw people closer to our Savior. So you can definitely find me on uh, Facebook, Jesse Owusu Ansa. You can also check me out on Instagram, Jesse underscore Owusu. And for Twitter, y'all be nice, because I'm just starting on Twitter. It is Jesse Owusu underscore.